How to look up a property on the zoning map. The city attempts to keep its website information up to date, although to obtain the most accurate information about the property zoning, please contact the city at 928-213-2000 and ask to speak with the Planning and Development Services Department's Planner of the Day. In addition, you may contact the Planner of the Day directly in accordance with the following days, times, phone numbers, and email addresses. 1. Navigate to the City of Flagstaff's website, which is www.flagstaff.az.gov. 2. Once the webpage loads, place the hand icon of your mouse point over the term government. The website government menu will appear. Under the department's heading, click on Community Development. 3. Once the web page loads, there are two links on this page to get to the zoning map. The first is under the quick links in the right-hand column. The second is under the heading, Zoning Code Administration, which is near the bottom of the web page. Click on either link. 4. Once the web page loads, Please read the pop-up message and click the OK. 5. In the lower right-hand corner there is the planning information menu. Sometimes, the app state pop-up will appear. If so, close the pop-up by clicking on the X in the right-hand corner of the pop-up. The planning information menu contains four icons. From left to right, the icons are, about icon. The layer list icon. The base map gallery and the search for address or parcel icon. 6. Click on the layer list icon. The layer list will appear. 7. Scroll down on the list and verify that the box next to zoning is checked. If not, click on the box to check it. 8. Continue to scroll down on the list and check the box next to special districts. 9. Under special districts, ensure that the National Register Historic Districts is checked. If not, click on the box to check it. Then click on the three dots on the right side of National Register Historic Districts. This will open a pop-up menu list. Click on the Enable Pop-up option. It shall be noted that the National Register Historic Districts are not zoning code zones, but they do affect what can be done on a property, and the city has certain requirements that need to be complied with. 10. Continue to scroll down on the list, and check the box next to Zoning Overlays. 11. Continue to scroll down on the list, and check the box next to Parcels. Then click on the three dots on the right side of Parcels. This will open a pop-up menu list. Click on the Enable pop-up option. 12. Click on the Search for Address or Parcel icon, or Magnifying Glass. 13. The Address or Parcel input search box will open in the lower right-hand corner. In this box, you may enter the parcel address. 14. For an example, I will use the Flagstaff Station, the Amtrak Depot, located at 1 East Route 66. When entering the address, you do not need to type out East or Street. The search bar uses standard address abbreviations, such as A for East and ST for Street. Click on the corresponding address. 15. Once the map loads, an address black dot appears in the street across from the parcel. You will need to know where the location of the property is since the parcel will not be highlighted. In the Flagstaff Station example, the station is on the south side of Route 66. 16. Click on the location where the property is located. A pop-up box will appear. Notice at the top of the box there is a 1 of 4 in the brackets. This indicates that there are 4 records. The first shows that the property is zoned with a regulation description of Highway Commercial, HC. Click on the arrow icon in the right-hand corner of the pop-up box. This will cause the second record to show. This record indicates that the property is in the Railroad Addition Historic District. Further down, the authority is the National Park Service. This indicates that the property is on the United States National Historic Register as being within a historic district. The United States National Historic Register Historic District is not a zoning designation, but it affects the property. Click on the arrow icon in the right-hand corner of the pop-up box. This will cause the third record to show. This record indicates the landmark overlay zone, 
which is a zoning map designation. Click on the arrow icon in the right-hand corner of the pop-up box, this will cause the fourth record to show. This is the property records information, please note, the property record shown in the property information records is provided monthly from the Coconino County. If there are errors, please contact Coconino County to have the information updated. Typically, the information is updated the next time the county provides an update to the city. Based on the information in the records, the property has a zoning designation of Highway Commercial, HC, Landmark Overlay, LO Zone. And, the property is in the United States National Historic Register's Railroad Edition, Historic District. Thank you for listening, and following along on the method to look up a property zoning designation. Please note, the city attempts to keep its website information up to date, although to obtain the most accurate information about the property zoning designation, please contact the city at 928-213-2000, and ask to speak with the Planning and Development Services Department's Planner of the Day. In addition, you may contact the Planner of the Day directly in accordance with the days, times, phone numbers, and email addresses.